Well, we're back at the pumpkin ranch. Got the mounds made for the pumpkins. As you can see, they're just a long row is the way I do it. But I'll tell you what, there ain't nothing like a nice big soft mound. <laughs> but anyways, I kind of worked this a little, little wet. But uh, it's going to be okay because I, what I do is I let it sit idle for about it'll sit idle for two weeks and what I'll do is I'll come in I'll spray my fertilizer on here and uh, spray my fertilizer on here and then uh well first what I'll do I should step back a step I'll let it sit idle and let all the weeds come up and uh, Mr. Computer he's he's still there but I'll let the weeds come all up and uh, then I'll come in and spray it with Roundup and uh, then I'll wait another week and do it again. And that'll kill everything off. And that'll give me a head start for uh, then I can spray my fertilizer. And I'll come back in with uh, with my disc and I'll uh, I'll hit these rows once, these mounds. I'll hit them once and loosen it back because they'll have a crust on it. I'll loosen it back up and then uh, I'll come and it'll mix the fertilizer in with it too on these and. Uh, then I'll come in, I'll start planting the, the giant ones. I'll plant them about uh, two weeks before, uh, about, about mid-June, uh, I should say. I may try a week later, maybe the third week of June, plant them. It just all depends on the weather. But that's when I'll come in, plant them, and then I'll get in, and uh, about two weeks later, I'll start planting the rest of them. The giant ones take more time to mature. But really, for working this wet like it did, I did just for a time span. I had it's supposed to rain again, so I got to work all weekend. So this was a good time to get in and do it. So uh, man, they really it turned out pretty good. But that's basically that procedure. So uh, I don't know. We'll get some videos of uh, the rest of the steps that I do, right or wrong. This is the way I've been doing it for the last couple of years seems to work pretty good but the weather's the biggest factor of course a pumpkin is basically a melon you know it likes lots of water but i've got certain steps if it gets dry what i do also too so but for the most part this is gonna pretty good seed bud so i don't know it's a freaking nice day we've seen a whole lot of them so far this year but i thought i'd get in and get this done probably take the tractor back park it come home and relax a little bit and then i have to go to the coal mine and make energy so oh well but yeah this is pretty much how this has ended up We've got 10 of these mounds so i think last year i planted 630 plants or seeds because i don't pre-plant them and let them come up but 630 seeds so it'll probably be about the same this year so we'll go from there and Hopefully the weather keeps coming my way and see what happens. But like, subscribe, rate, comment, suggest, I don't care. Hopefully one of these days I can afford a GoPro, but I like spending my money on pleasures or finer things. <laughs> Alright, thanks.